Hi, and welcome to the Speckim IQ tutorial series. I'm Gaela from Speckim, and in this tutorial I will briefly present the main functionalities and relations of the Speckim IQ Studio software. The Speckim IQ Studio is the accompanying software for the Speckim IQ camera, which allows you to manage the data that you've collected, to build models and applications to be used with the device, and to control the device settings. Let's open up the software and have a look. All of the main functionalities are available on the leftmost bar. Under the label General, you will find the sections for Catalog, Device, and Applications. Below these functions, you will also see the memory cards and card readers attached to your computer. The catalog is a place where you can store, manage and research the recorded data. The recorded data sets can be imported to the catalogs directly from the device with an USB connection, from the memory card on the card reader or from a folder on your hard drive. When starting Speckim IQ Studio, this is the default view. In the device view, you can manage your Speckim IQ device. After you connect the device to your computer using a USB cable, you can change the device settings and install and uninstall applications. You can also create profiles, which are preset settings and application packages that can be installed to any IQ device you are using. The applications view has three separate tabs. Applications, Models, and Spectral Libraries. In the Spectral Libraries tab, you can create and manage your own spectral libraries. These can be made by yourself from your data, or you can import existing libraries. You also have the option of exporting libraries from the Speckim IQ Studio. On the Models tab, you can manage both model projects as well as finalized models. In the Applications tab, you have the control over the application projects and ready-made applications. Before going further into Models and Applications view, let's see a graph explaining the hierarchy and relations between models, applications and profiles. As we can see, the model is presented inside the application and the application again inside the profile. This means that to create an application, we will need a model. A model contains information about data processing, information extraction, visualization definitions and settings. In short, the model inside an application defines how the collected data is being processed. The application then defines how the data recorded with the Speccy MyQ camera is visualized and saved. An application combines the model settings with the imaging settings. The ready applications are then included as a part of a profile, which is then installed to the Speccy MyQ. A profile can contain one or more applications as well as various device settings, such as the timeout setting for power saving. You can save multiple profiles in the Speccy MyQ Studio and quickly load a profile into any Speccy MyQ camera. Let's return to the IQ Studio now. In the Models tab, you have both the model projects and ready saved models. The My Models list presents the ready models which are ready to be used in applications. In My Model Project list, you can see the model projects. These can be edited whereas the ready models cannot be. You can create a new project by selecting it from the burger menu. To open an existing project, either select it from the burger menu or by double-clicking the projects. This is the identification model creator, the place where you can create models. The user goes through the workflow one tab at a time, starting with the Project tab 
and moving all the way down to the Test Run tab. This is where the model project can then be saved into an actual model. A saved model then appears to the list of ready models. Ready models can be used in applications. Returning to the Applications view, we also have the list of ready applications and application projects. Applications on the My Applications list are ready to be loaded to the Speckium IQ camera. To create a new project, select it from the burger menu. To open up an existing project, you can either use the burger menu or double click on the projects. In the application creator, applications are created by following the workflow from the project tab to the test run tab. This is where the application project can again be saved into a ready application. Created applications can be loaded to the Speckium IQ device one by one, or they can be included as part of a profile. In the case you don't have the Speckium IQ connected to the computer, or there are no memory cards inserted to the card reader or computer, the memory cards list will be empty. As soon as you connect either of the previous, the usable memory card is listed under the memory cards. To examine and import the recorded data, the targeted memory card can be selected. These were the main functionalities of the Speckium IQ Studio software. If you found this video useful, do give it a like, and please subscribe to the Speckium Spectral YouTube channel to follow our tutorial series on the Speckium IQ. Thank you for watching, and see you in the next video!